With more than 100 cases of cholera now reported in Siaya County since its outbreak, efforts to contain the disease continues in several parts of the county as the death toll rises to four. Speaking during the flagging off of modern ambulances at the county headquarters, Siaya Governor James Orengo lamented the slow progress to deal with the disease which was first reported two months ago. Orengo, who was accompanied by the county commissioner, cited the need for the residents to support the efforts to curb the disease through observing proper hygiene. Of the four deaths, one was a person who was having an underlying condition, and three of them were kids who were taken to hospital a little bit too late in the day, uh, so that if people can take these cases in, in good time to the facilities, we should not be having any fatalities. So far, he says, the county medics have been able to pitch camps along the beaches of Rarienda and Bondo sub-counties, which are epicenters of the disease. These ambulances that we, uh, we are launching today, uh, they are like a, a mini uh, ICU. The facilities they have uh, like a mini ICU. And we are very happy about the acquisition of these ambulances. One is going to go to Bondo, and the other one is going to go to Siaya. So two of them are going to go to Siaya, one to Bondo. On his part, County Commissioner Jim Joker cited the need for the government's health department to sustain the crackdown in eateries that are not compliant with the public health requirements. Once you have symptoms of cholera, which is diarrhea, deformity, rush to the nearest health facility and you'll be helped. Get Brigade, K24 Nairobi.